Hey what is up everybody, today I'm going to be showing you how to access the developer settings on your xbox phone and the first thing you want to do is go to settings and then from here you're going to want to go down to system, console info you're going to want to push the left bumper, right bumper, left trigger and right trigger and then you should get the developer settings, you want to open it up and then go down here where it says sandbox id and you're going to want to erase that and you're going to want to put in all caps make sure you put this in all caps and correct because if you don't you could break your xbox and that'd be no good but you're going to want to put in x d k s dot one i want to make sure i put it in right because every time i do this i get scared x d k s dot one x d k s dot one alright so it looks like it's right hopefully i don't fuck up my xbox but once you put it in you can just push b um push any button after that and it'll it'll ask you if you want to it'll ask you if you want to restart your xbox go ahead and put restart now and now your xbox will restart and once it comes back on you'll have developer um it'll be in the developer mode whatever i'm just gonna leave the video playing while it restarts you guys can skip ahead a couple of seconds but i'm gonna leave it playing I think you can get a custom uh, gamer picture that says Xbox One, but I've never done it. I'm gonna check it out, see if we can. Always takes forever. And I thought the 360 took too long. Alright, so I'm back in. Let me turn on my controller because it turned off. Uh, it should say... It, if you know you did it right, because you won't be able to do, really do anything. Like I said before, this is just... I don't know why you would do it, but... It's, it's just there. It's something you can do. Like, um, if I try to start up a game, it's not going to let me play watch. Yeah, see, there it is. It's, it's, it's weird. You can't really play, uh, but, yeah, well, you're in developer mode. Wait. Look, they got a custom picture. That's cool. But, uh, let me check out the thing I was telling you about where you can get the custom pictures. Now you go to... If I can remember how to change it, I think it's my profile. And then, no. Customize profile? Yeah, there it is. Change game pick. I don't know. Yeah, see, there it is. The first one. You can't get that normally, so that's another cool thing about this. That your friends won't know how you got that picture. I'm going to go ahead and set it. That's pretty cool. I've never actually done it, but as you can see, it works. There's also some things you can get from the store. Um, some maps or games you couldn't normally get. I think you type in games. I don't remember. It's been a while since I've done this. Let's try it. Let's try it. Type in games. Yeah, and I forgot how to do it. But anyways, that's how you get into developer mode. There really isn't much to do. Other than get that gamer picture that no one else has. Oh, <laughs> look at that. It's got three question marks on what, what it says that I'm doing. But yeah, thanks for watching. Let me know if you have any questions. And if you fuck up your Xbox.